Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back to another Facebook pickups video and in this blah, in this video I show you the stuff that I picked up recently or since the last Facebook pickups video which was a wee while ago now. I'm um, just going to have a little drink because oh my throat is absolutely killing right now. So yeah, there hasn't been a much to be fair kicking about. I've just been looking on and off every now and again. I haven't really found much that's taken my eye or taken my fancy at all, if I'm being honest. Um, there's a couple of Game Boy games and some Sega Master System stuff. So I swooped in, swooped in on them, grabbed them, and I now have them. So I'm going to show you what I got. So first up was a bundle of Game Boy games somebody was selling. He was selling off his collection. Um, thankfully, he wasn't selling all in bulk, like one big collection load of games, like a lot of people are. Um, I've seen a few on Gumtree that are doing that, but um, this guy was just selling all his games listed. If you wanted any, pick them out, he was going to give you a price, um, and there you go. So first up that I saw, now I know this is, oh, I know this is a pirate, so don't worry, I know it's a pirate, uh, but that's Snow White. Um, you can tell basically by the cover art that that's a pilot, a pilot, a pirate um, also as well. It's a bit blurry, can't quite tell. It's actually not too bad, a cover. Um, it's ever so slightly blurry. Um, and yeah, it is a pirate, but it's not not a problem. This was never an official release on Game Boy, um, as is, like that. But it's good for the collection, because I also pick up pirated Game Boy games as well, so that's no problem. Right, this next one's a little bit funny, um, a little bit quirky, because it isn't a game. It is, if I can get the fucking thing open, there we go. It's InfoGenius Pro Productivity Pack Personal Organizer with Phone Book. How fucking awesome is that? Personal Organizer with Phone Book. Yeah. That'll do. Didn't have that one, actually. Um, I think I had, well, I think I had a French one a while ago. Um, but that went missing. Because there's a few Game Boy games I have have gone missing. And um, that one kind of went walkabout. But yeah, that's part of the collection. So there's Spanish, French, I think there's an Italian one, a German one. Um, I'm not sure what else there is, actually. There's a calculator as well. Fuck it. Right. Next game for the old collection is um, Super Hunchback starring Quasimodo. Which... Again, I had, um, but it went walkabout, so I've got it back in the collection now, so that's awesome. Last uh, three games, there was one more game, it was um, Swamp Thing, um, but I have since swapped that on with someone else, because I already had it. Um, Vegas Stakes, didn't have that one. Swamp Thing you actually threw in for free, because I bought this lot, and I was speaking to him about it, um, Cause, and he told me there was a crack in the back of it, and I was like, oh, well, I'm not too bothered about it. But he gave me it anyway, which was really decent of him. Um, USA World Cup USA 94, which I didn't actually know was on the Game Boy, so boost. And last one, staying on the Olympic, well, staying on the Olympic theme? I wasn't Olympic. This is. Um, US Gold Presents Winter Olympics. Uh, the Lilhammer 94 Olympics. Cool. Which I also have for the Sega Master System and the Mega Drive. So, awesome. So that's six, technically seven, uh, Game Boy games, if you include Swamp Thing. All there. Um, really pleased with that. And it's nice to see somebody actually selling Game Boy games again, because I haven't seen anybody selling them for a while. Um, and yeah, it is. It's just nice to, to know people are still interested in them, which is really, really cool. And altogether, that came to £20 posted. So, really, that's a bargain. Um, some of these games go for a bit more and of course for my collection all in hard cases as well which again trying to find them all in hard cases is a fucking nightmare so uh, yeah really pleased to get those in the collection so it's another six Game Boy games to the collections so that boosts that by oh, quite a bit we're into the 400s now um, so we're getting close to a full oh god sorry about that a full PAL collection anyway of course, we're missing quite a few rares, but we'll get there eventually. It's not a 
It's not a race. It's not a sprint. We'll get there when we get there. Right. Next up, I have two Sega Master System games. Um, now, I already have these, but these are the card versions of those games. Now, I picked up one a while ago called Transbot. I think that was in episode 103 or something like that. Um, and that was my very first Sega card game. I wasn't sure if I was going to continue collecting them. But um, I am going for a full Master System set. So it's going to be... I will need them at some stage. And somebody was selling two that I didn't have. So I decided, right, fuck it. Let's go for it. Um, first up is My Hero. Sega card. And uh, boxed. And complete a The card has got the little cover, which I am looking for. Um, so yeah, My Hero. In fine enough condition. Not really too bothered about the condition of these. So long as they're complete. That, that does the job for me. And the last one is Ghost House. Which is a little bit worse condition. The corners come off here. It hasn't affected the inlay. Um, but the corners come off the box. And uh, I might need to get a replacement manual. Because it is a little bit uh, marked there. But again, the card is complete with a little plastic covering. So yeah, I'm not going to argue with that. That came to £25 posted for the two. Um, my hero can go for quite a bit. It can go for around about 20 25 quid. Um, Ghost House. I don't know. I can find that for around about a tenner. So it's not too bad. Um, but yeah, I was happy to pay that. And that's two extra card games in the collection. So I now have three of them. Um, I would love to get more. Uh, there's a few out there that are really hard to get a hold of. I know... Um, what is it? Oh, fucking hell, it's just gone right out of my head. Hang on. Super hang on. Well, hang on. On the Master System is hard to get. Um, the red one is very, very hard to get. But yeah, I'm just going to pick these up when, you know, as and when I see them. So I saw two of them in one lot, which is the first time I've seen that in a while. So I just thought, right, going to go for them. Thankfully, nobody asked about them. And I managed to pick them up. So really pleased to get them in the collection. So that's Master System cards and Game Boy games. Boom. Um, and that's, yeah, that's my latest Facebook pickups video. So thanks very much for watching, guys. Please rate, comment, and, sub and subscribe. God, it's been ages since I've been in front of the camera doing a video. It's been a while. Um, but yeah, but that's it. So take it easy, and I'll see you in the next one. Um, oh, fucking, this eye is falling asleep right now. Um, oh, a bit of a lazy eye going on there. But anyway, yeah, so take it easy. Uh, let me know what you think in the comments below. Um, let me know what you think of this series in general. There's a few of them that I've done in the past. Uh, I did one recently, um, like after like a year and a half, two years of a gap between them. But I am still perusing Facebook. I am still trying to find some stuff. There's a couple of other things as well that didn't quite go, th go to plan or didn't go through. Um, so I couldn't get them in this video. But hopefully we'll get another deal on Facebook soon. And I will catch up with you again. Take it easy and I will see you soon. Bye.